This is the actual Jupiter, not really, but a simulation and part of Jupiter. Yeah, if I spawn Jupiter in here, and today we are going to blow Jupiter up. And this is going to be easy, we just need a lever. A lever. We need, we need this single lever, and we place it on the very we top. This place it here. Yeah, place it here and turn it on. But before that. Oh, the sun is rising. Nice. The moon is setting. But, as the sun rises, let's look at the great red spot. Great spot. As the sun rises. Then I'll set it back. Then I'll wait for it to become night time again. And then we'll blow it up. The sun is going to rise. Rising sun. Hey, do you like sunrises? I like it. I'm, I'm actually staring at the floor. So what I'm going to do. The sun is about to rise from the asses. Am I supposed to look at the great red spot? Well, let's look at this. Glory. Storm. Let's talk about it. The great red spot is a big storm the size of Earth. And it's been going for centuries. Normal. Yes, it's a red storm. Well, basically, it's a hurricane going for centuries. No, we are. Hurricane goes for like a few days or weeks. I did experience in storm. A hurricane, but I was at the very edge of it. Which is interesting, but hurricanes are strong, they're very windy. But this big red spot is the windiest. It goes up to One earth per day, probably. I think that. I don't know. I don't know. One earth per day? Yeah. One earth per day. Probably spin. I don't think that's very fast. I don't know. <sighs> About like two or three years. I think. Mean, you see here, each block can fit a single earth. That's crazy. It's very huge that it combine is equal to two times um, equals almost 
two times the mass of all the planets combined. But that's nothing compared to the sun. The sun holds up to 99.86% of the mass in the solar system is owned by the sun. And fun fact, the Pluto is not a planet, but it used to be the size of Neptune. But it shrank and shrank and shrank. When we discovered it, it shrank quite a lot. Still, but then it shrank, it kept shrinking, shrinking, and then we they noticed it canceled the book. Noticed. This, I mean, shrank like this and made it a door. But actually, the real reason is it shrank. But actually, it shrank too much that it d does not have the grav power to clear off its clear uh, clean its orbit. So the orbit got rusty and. He turned into a dwarf planet. Yeah, that's the story of Pluto. It's moon. Basically, let me resume the game. And come on. Let me. Set. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> what the? Hot go. <laughs> let's try again. Midnight. Oh, what is wrong with me? When is it time set? No, it's set time, right? Time. Midnight Sunday next. Finally, oh, here's Jupiter. It's great rich food with two Earths. By the way, did you know the Uranus? Oh, no, I mean. Neptune also has a, a spot. It's uh, I think it's called the it's called the dark blue spot. And wait, the fastest wind speeds are recorded on Neptune. So so. I believe that the dark blue spot spins about 
twenty thousand billion trillion and hertz per hour or second no hour yep twenty billion tr twenty thousand tr billion trillion and hertz per second that's i i guess the I think the fastest, fastest wind speeds are recorded on Neptune are um, 600, 1, okay, 600 septillion and hertz per second. Yeah, that's the best. Where did the moon go? Okay, let's quickly. What I'm gonna do before I want to know what will happen if humans landed on Jupiter when it explodes. Yes. Yep. So let's set set it to survival. Ah. Uh, okay. Okay. Break it. Jupiter! Jupiter's gone! Oh no. Uh. Run. I died again. Generating war. No. My bed broke! No. No. Jupiter. Yeah. See? This view. Abyss. in this frosted area. I use nether portals to escape. 